because I caught some of this interview, and I want you to talk about it. We asked Gary Leonard about the chaos in Washington. Uh, Speaker McCarthy out. You talked to uh, Massachusetts Congressman Jake Auchincloss about his vote in this. He was, and of course, one of the Democrats, because all of them, including Seth Magaziner and Bill Keating, voted to oust McCarthy. Uh, and so I asked him about the criticism that Democrats, you know, shouldn't have reinforced that faction of the Republicans uh, who were, you know, interested in sowing yeah. chaos. Here's what Auchincloss uh, had to say. Did the Democrats incentivize or disincentivize any bipartisanship, meaning the next speaker will be even less likely to not shut down the government and things like that? I mean, what do you say to that idea that whether McCarthy was, in your eyes, a good actor or not, that it's just you got to take the best Republican you had on offer, and maybe that was him? The currency of speakership in Congress is trust. And Kevin McCarthy had gone bankrupt his own conference did not trust him because he lied to them. And Democrats did not trust him because repeatedly he would make a promise either to the president or to Democrats, and then he would renege upon it under pressure from Trump and the MAGA wing. So there's no negotiation to be had when there's no trust as the basis of it. As I've said, as the Democratic minority leader has said repeatedly, we are very cognizant in the House that we're in the minority. If we want to pass policy, we're going to need Republican votes on immigration reform, on lowering health care costs. And I'm personally invested in this. I've got legislation that has Republican co-sponsors. So we are not blind to the fact that you've got to have Republican uh, votes to pass what we want to do. But we're not going to be fooled for a third time with somebody who has repeatedly uh, gone back on his word. Well, Congressman uh, Jake Auchincloss on why he voted to oust uh, Kevin McCarthy, his explanation, but it's not surprising. I mean, that the Democrats would uh, do that. We've talked a lot about the first congressional race.